this stuff. Was pretty sweet. I don't think there's anything here that I really want besides maybe those treads. We're running low on matter though. Reinforced Deutrium Engine. Oh yeah, I don't want to look at these traits. Okay. So this is just like where bad guys live. I got caved in on. Well, that was bad. Alright, treads need to go on. Scatter rocket array needs to go on. Well, these guys don't take that much damage from the scatter rocket arrays. So we need to come here. Put these guys on. Put this guy on. Put this guy on. Um, pick up this matter. Look at this. Unpowered arcs. High capacity batteries. Looks like I need something stronger than that. Oh, I do have a data jack. For some reason I thought I didn't have one.
warmer in C. Um, okay, so I want less grunts, more swarmers. Pods. I don't think there's anything that I can do. Yep, I can't rewire them. I um, also don't think I can try this. But their system's offline. That makes sense. And like, this is not a sentry, it's a carrier. Otherwise, that would be sweet. And here's an exit. Sweet. Uh, let's do two more of these. And then we're going to call it a night. All right, that's going to be it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully we get to try out a few of these. I forgot that I had that data jack, so we'll definitely do some non-combat ones here soon. So, uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. This was Nuzcraft. We'll see you again next time. Take care. Bye bye. All right. Hello, everybody. This is Nuzcraft, and welcome back to some Cogmind. It's been a long time since I've played. I started a new run in Beta 7 a while back and haven't touched it for a couple weeks, I think. So let's try and get back in the swing of things, review where we were, where we went. So we started mats, we hit storage, and then we actually went into a garrison um, and made it to recycling. In that garrison, we got, uh, what's it called, a riff. We got a riff installed, which is one of the new features of Beta 7, which will let us get into some robot hacking which is what we're going to try and do a little bit of here on sub-level 6. So taking a look at our loot, we've got these relay, coupl relay couplers. These are what we use for robot hacking. We've got NC is non-combat bots, swarmers, grunts, and sentries. And we have a data jack that will actually let us, uh, let us play with it. So... That being said, let's kind of get started. I'm going to go ahead and throw this treads on. It's going to be a little bit quicker. Um, I'm going to throw a cooling system on and yeah, just an improved heat sink. Uh, when we find some fun bots to play with, that's when we'll swap in the relay couplers. All right. See, we're not much for machine hacking. Ooh, that's not good. We've got an investigation squad heading our way. Shield generator. There's some matter. Let's see if we can recall the investigation squad.
Nope, we got another investigation squad heading our way. Mm, coolant injector. Transmission jammer. Focal shield. Kinetic damage resistance. That might not be bad with a couple investigations heading our way. Let's see. Wonder where the investigations are gonna come from. Well, there's a high explosive trap, which means there's probably another one directly south of us. So let's go this way. Hey YouTube's TV, how you doing? Well, that's a weird little room. Don't see that in level generation that often. Uh, let's see. Nothing much there. We haven't seen like any enemies. Let's see, Gauss Rifle. Okay, hold on. Oh, Tobes TV. <laughs> oh, man. My bro, uh, he he changed his, his Twitch name. It's Tobes TV. But he can't hear me because he's, he's watching without sound, so he can't hear me say anything. All right, let's get going. Scanalyzer Proton Cannon. These things are cool. It's electromagnetic. We don't have much in the way of electromagnetic. Um, let's drop this Gauss Cannon and pick up a Proton Cannon. Actually, we can just pick it up. Though, I do want this wheel. You're gonna be like, Nuzcraft, this is just a compact wheel, why would you want that? I have these treads, but these two are running on empty. And I, the only backup propulsion I have is a single leg. The wheel can get you very far. Okay, here we go. Let's pull off the heat sink. We're gonna put on this relay coupler. We're then gonna throw on a data jack and we're gonna play around with this guy. All right, so we've hacked a recycler. We've got these basic jacks, Parsisum, no distress, find recycling. So I think you can do these uh, even without a coupler, like this guy, or this guy, even without this guy. Ignore parts. I believe then this is, you've got the riff, so you've, you've gone into a, a garrison but you still don't have the coupler. You can ignore parts. But now if you have the coupler, we can generate echo, overload power, link field of view, stream control low, generate anomaly, format sys low, or start evac. Let's do this generate echo. So that showed me that there's a bot over here. Interesting. Overload power. So now I think it's gonna blow up. Oh, that's so cool. Medium storage unit. Compact wheel. All right, I don't need all of these heat sinks. That 
is so cool. All right, we're gonna we're gonna throw this flat gun back on, and we're gonna wait around for another non-combat bot to play with. Force rifle, long range track beam. I don't know anything about force rifles. Thermal. Let's see. Would we drop improved DM shotgun? It's fine. All right, we've got programmers headed our way. Ooh, we've got improved proton missile launchers. These might be better than the scatter rocket arrays. Well, no. It's Scatter rocket arrays are really good. But I want to pick it up just for funsies. Let's see. We have a proton cannon. What else is over here? Phase cannons. And an energy filter. And do this. Uh, do we want to drop one of these flat cannons for it? I don't think so. I think we're just going to keep on with what we had. There's an informer. So this is a watcher class. which we don't have a, uh, we don't have a relay couplet for. So we can't do much for it. There's nobody around us though, so. 42%, is that not even worth taking the shot? EM shield. Oh man, that's what I wanted to, hmm. 37% chance to hit. We're going to try and get closer. We should probably put this leg on too. There we go. Uh, target analyzer. Shock rifle. Ooh, a remote data jack. I definitely want that. Alright, what can we drop? For the remote data jack. I want to keep the regular data jack around. Well, do I? I'll just go for the remote data jack. Actually, I can hold them both. But I think there's better things to be held. This EM shield, maybe? Wonder if I can repair anything. Probably not. No. Alarm trap. There's a slayer. Which is unfortunate. Hmm. Because they can shoot through things. I'm not in a good position. I don't know that he saw us though, so we might be okay. Target analyzer, and I don't think he's a sentry or a grunt or a swarmer. Let's wait another, what, 20 turns? I 
maneuvering thrusters, advanced signal interpreters. Um, signal interpreter is nice, but I'm not going to go for it. Let's see if I can do. See, there's branch access points at 14%. Locate traps at 29 We're actually pretty close with that locate traps. There's a soldier. Alright, we're gonna let him come to us. Or it. We lost the treads. Throw a wheel up there for some coverage. Not much, mind you. I think, uh,. Yeah, 3% coverage. There we go. Let's see, only drop some matter. Alright, I wonder what this guy does. Alright, so... I think you can right click on these. Okay, look, parts system read, system data, learn more about the current state and capabilities. Also identifies all parts. Adds them to the item gallery if not already. Cool. No distress. All right, so generate echo. Destabilize power systems, generate a wave of energy. So it will identify robots within a range of 20. Map the Earth. We'll map all of the Earth within a range of 25. Overload power. Makes sense. Permanently add new paths to the local complex layout. Tap into the system's visual feed for 100 turns. But you must remain within a range of 20. Hijack the control node to force system to act as an ally. Huh. Oh, so you can like lead it to a new place. You can generate a distress call. Make it a permanent ally. and you can make it start an evacuation. That's interesting. I'm gonna do map the earth. Oh, that is so useful. Look at that. That is useful. So then you can see like, we've got a room down here. This is all a room. This is a room. Oh, that's so cool. Improved sensor array. Here's a garrison. Let's see if we can seal it. Oops. We've got an investigation squad. Let's see if I can turn off the investigation. Probably not though. 0% chance. Whoa. The Sentinel. I really don't want to stay in this room though. Or get out of this room. Oh, what? Hold on. This guy is a sentry. So, if we take off. Probably the improved cooling system. Just for funsies. Look at this. Oh man. Look at this. Okay, find shortcuts. Of course. Force the system to prioritize attacking Cogmind. Offset targeting algorithms. 
Wow, render propulsion unusable. Mark this bot to make it the most attractive target to all allies. Spike heat. Wipe record. Wow, that's cool. Permanently half movement speed. Tap into systems combat decision making processes in real time, increasing your accuracy and damage against this bot by 25%. Wow. Giving yourself and all allies 25% better accuracy against this and all Obi Wan O combat bots within a range of three. This is cool. We can overload the power. Find the nearest garrison. Show paths. Only effective when targeting a patrol squad leader. Okay. Get the FOV, disable weapons, reboot the system, go dormant, overwrite IFF, trick system of believing it is allied with Cogmine. After 10 turns, the network will perform an automated quick boot. All right. So we could get a permanent ally, but I think we're just going to disable weapons for now. That's cool. We got a drone bay, kinetic acceleration can, or magnetic Mac, kinetic accelerator, increased ballistic gun cannon minimum damage by thirty percent. Can increase beyond the weapon's maximum. This is cool. So this is one of the new things um, that is add in the added in the newest update. The kinet accelerator. We're gonna attach it. To put it in the gallery. Then put this back. Prototype energy cannons. Coil guns. I don't think we need a coil gun. Maybe we do. We'll drop in the flat guns. Cool. And Faulty Compact Ion Cannon. We lost an engine. We got a Slayer coming through, and we're hot. Let's see. That's because we took off our... Let's see, can we do this? We could reboot the system. What does this do? Oh yeah, disrupt area. All right, we initiated. There we go. We lost the treads. Let's throw a wheel back on. Going with wheels, we can go a little bit faster. 